Hello friends, loved ones, and other creatures from the deep, dark internet. My name is Dr. Rice, also known as Dr. Mitch, and welcome back to the channel for yet another COVID-19 update. Today's gonna be a shorter video discussing the more recent updates about the new variants BA4 and BA5 here in the United States, as well as speaking on behalf of just how far we've all come through this pandemic. We are now two and a half years since news first broke about COVID-19, and it's really hard to believe it's been that long. We've had so many ups and downs, and my heart truly breaks for all the family, loved ones, and other individuals around the world who have unfortunately lost their lives due to COVID-19. My heart also really pours out to the individuals who have had their lives dramatically changed by losing a loved one or a family member or a dear friend to COVID-19, and knowing that our lives are permanently changed because of this. I want to commend all of us, especially you watching this video, for persevering through all of the unknown, including in the midst of all this uncertainty and getting through to the other side that we are today. Your bravery is what has allowed us to see overall cases, hospitalizations, and deaths due to COVID-19 dwindle, especially over the last six months. It appears COVID, while being endemic, will likely continue to fizzle out over the next few seasons. For this, we can all say hallelujah. of the new variants that have been emerging, the BA4 and BA5, there's no evidence that we have today that these variants are any worse than previous variants that we've had. In fact, preliminary evidence shows that these variants are less virulent than the variants we've had before. Although hospitalizations have slightly increased over the last few weeks here in the United States, it's likely that these variants will come and go and not last a long time. As I've mentioned in previous videos, COVID-19 will likely and is becoming endemic. With the continual development of variants variants that will likely come and go, with an extremely low probability of any single one of these new variants being as virulent or as deadly, if you will, compared to both the Delta and the Omicron variants. If you're watching this video and you're hearing me talk about the word endemic and you're not quite familiar with that term or you're thinking that endemic simply means the end of the pandemic, I highly encourage you to check out my video discussing what endemic means and I'll link that here in the top corner as well as in the description below. With more good news, many individuals obtained natural immunity from when the Omicron wave came in and wreaked havoc all throughout the United States. This actually turned out to be a good thing because we know that the overall efficacy from natural immunity is actually slightly superior than that of vaccine immunity. We also can deduce the likelihood that the natural immunity that we have will likely be much better at fighting off the BA4 and BA5 variants. If you want me to cover a specific COVID topic that I haven't covered yet, please leave a comment down below. As always guys, thank you so much for sticking with me to the end of this video, and I will see you all on the next one.